What's up everybody, Tim Murphy with Drift Sessions. I'm here with our number one qualifier, Dirk Stratton. Dirk, how's it feel to be number one? Feeling great, we've got a ton of confidence coming into today and we're just ready to throw down. What are some of the challenges that you face this season of Clutch Kickers? Mainly the temperature, just keeping the car cool. You know, we don't have a ton of room here to run the car to keep it cool, you know, airflow wise. So just keeping the car cool and keeping it on track, consistency is the biggest thing. So the more laps you can make here, I don't care who you are. If you just started out, you're a ex-pro like me, whatever, um, seat time's the key. So tell everybody what, like, your experience, your history. A lot of the people that are watching know you already, but there are going to be a lot of people that don't know you. So fill us in on your background. Yeah, so uh, I started out uh, 2015 with this car in uh, MDU, won the Pro-Am Championship, got our Pro 2 license, went to Pro 2, uh, ran Pro 2 for two years, got Rookie of the Year, went into Pro 1, and uh, we got Rookie of the Year in that as well. We had a really good time. Uh, things got kind of tough in 2019. We had a lot of issues with the car. Um, so we decided to kind of take a more of a fun approach and do events like this and, and grid life and just have fun with it. Yeah. That's why we do it. Yeah. Well, I have to just personally tell you that I'm not really a big fan of the Corvette drifting, but like you have changed my my thought and I, I love your car. What inspired like the design and the color and everything? Yeah, so really when we built the car in 2015, there really were no Corvettes out there, not many, a few here and there in the past. So we wanted to just take a different approach and keep it kind of simple, look like a nice clean street car. Okay. And that's, that's where we went with it. Just make it look clean and, and showy. So now we're going to go back to Clutch Kickers. As far as Clutch Kickers, what do you think it is about this series that sets it apart from everybody else? The driving. I mean, uh, a lot of what they say is it's all for the drivers, and it really is. Um, we get a lot of seat time, and there's a ton of good dudes that come out here and drive. It doesn't matter who it is. And the track, the size of it, it it's a leveling for the, for the cars. So it doesn't matter if you've got a 300-horsepower car or 800-horsepower car. Everybody has a chance because of the size of the track comes down to the driver a lot of times what would you say you enjoy most about clutch kickers just being able to come out here and and you know of course you're taking it serious because you want to do well but you know what if you take it too serious and it doesn't become fun anymore what are you doing here right. you know right. it's, it's about having fun yeah. so this year of drifting do you have anything that you'd say you're grateful for this year I'm just grateful for all my friends and family really that helped me out uh, without them I wouldn't be able to do this at all so, of course, you know, all my sponsors, uh, Ling and Performance Engineering and Oracle Lighting, uh, Conseil Wheels, everybody really helps me out a lot and wouldn't be able to do it without them. But the support from my family is, uh, is great. Just everybody putting a hand in. Um, what did you do to prepare for today's competition? Anything different than normal? Uh, nothing crazy. You know, we, we got here about 7.15, you know, get here early, get the car out, get it warmed up, you know, lift it up nut and bolt it check it over but nothing crazy right, good deal uh, is there um the, for those that are watching today how can they find you on instagram or facebook uh instagram's just dirk underscore stratton and official dirk stratton on facebook all right. i'm gonna hit you with the lightning round questions okay are you ready absolutely all right simple questions five questions are you ready we're gonna go one two three cat or dog cat ocean or lake ocean rb or jay-z Neither. Oh, that's what Pat Good said. Okay, we're going to go with, uh, oh, you totally threw me off there. Um, sweet or spicy? Spicy. Uh, spicy man here, Dirk Stratton. Thank you for your time. We look forward to you. Number one qualifier. He walked away with $1,000 yesterday. Guys, stay tuned. Keep an eye on this man. Woo!